oh, the beautiful Los Angeles River. If anyone's ever wondered what it looks like. Beautiful, lush. Uh-oh, that happened. And then that happened. It's like, you're doing a great job. <laughs> go really close to the store. Like, where do I go now, left? Yeah, go left. Left here? Yeah, and then you're gonna make a right at the next light. Oh God. <laughs> you look great. Oh, uh, I'm just hoping that all of this gets back to the house in one piece. You look really capable right now. Yeah, I'm doing it. Yeah, I'm kidding in the candy store. Good morning. It's one of these mornings. Last night in the dark, I spray painted my new elephant that I got, so we're gonna go check it out. Oh, it needs some work. <laughs> look at this new buddy. Hey, buddy. Why does this look like this? Yo, you're drunk. I put my hair in a bun like that because I'm tricking people into thinking I might get together. Life hack. Oh, hello again. Uh, just got done a meeting with Represent, which is the company that I just did the uh, limited edition It's Grace t-shirts through that you guys bought like maniacs. We had a really great creative meeting to discuss the next uh, piece of merch that I want to make available for you guys. It's gonna be really cool. I wanna create merch that isn't Grace Helbig specific, that is just clothes that you would like uh, if you didn't know who I was. Do you guys like raglans and or do you like hoodless sweatshirts? Cool! Good talk. That one! I'm free right yeah, now. Wasn't ready for that one. That's so I'm bad. videoing. <laughs> Hannah videoing. 30 seconds. We're on Lance's uh, Dirty Pop show. Oh it's God, really we, exciting. We just got double teams right now. Yeah, like sorry. Hannah, sorry, dude. Everything's very pensive. <laughs> <laughs> this feels very threatening. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. I got a housewarming gift from my mom today. She gave me this. It's a wind chime with butterflies on it because my mom sincerely loves butterflies. I think she thinks that she's a human butterfly. Um, and then I got a really sweet note from her. I'm not gonna read it to you because it's just for me. Now you know that my mom fully supports 1-800-Flowers. <laughs> What are you doing? We're in a car, head into the airport. I knew if I was quiet long enough, you would take over and handle this vlog. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, someone let this lion come to Washington, D.C. for a very special meeting. It's 7 a.m. right now. Get ready to go to a very special meeting that came up very last minute. There are tigers. Oh my god, I hate everything. I was gonna make this great tigers and bears joke in addition to me being a lion. And now life just sucks. Okay, back in the hotel room. Slightly less lioness than before. Uh, today's been a really crazy day. I got to go to the White House with a bunch of other YouTubers. Here are some videos. And I got to watch an event uh, for a new initiative that the White House is doing called It's On Us dot org. That is the president's podium. It's all about preventing sexual harassment. I got to see Vice President Biden and President of the United States Barack Obama speak, and I was two rows back while they spoke.
It was really very surreal. A young girl, I think my age, spoke before Joe Biden and she was raped when she was a freshman in college and she talked all about how uh, getting into college is hard and getting back your college experience is extremely hard after you've had uh, an experience of sexual harassment. And it was really, really moving. They launched the campaign today and I wanted to mention it to you guys because I think that it is so important. The whole um, I guess message of the campaign is that it's on all of us as a community to prevent sexual harassment. It's on us as adults to teach children, mostly males, that uh, their masculinity is not these old, very um, wrong standards. Boys used to be taught that they're dangerous and the girls used to be taught that boys are dangerous. That's crazy. We're all human beings is what we need to be taught and a certain level of respect among humans as humans is is the only thing that matters. There's absolutely no no time or place or reason for why a man should ever raise his hand or harass a woman ever or a man for that matter because this happens to men too. I've had one of those days that came up out of nowhere and wasn't totally sure what exactly it was and have been totally influenced and um, empowered by everyone that spoke today and everything that happened today. If you feel so inclined, go to itsonus.org and um, you can take the pledge on us to um, teach youth what it means to be a human in the world. Um, and not what it means to take advantage of humans in the world. This might not be the last time that I talk about this because I feel really, oh, I feel like I just want everyone to be nice. What a day, whew. Okay, I'm gonna take a nap. I don't know. Stop, you're still recording. Yeah, big time. All right. Does it feel weird to eat a sandwich on camera? It feels... Yeah, this is like a Carl's Jr. commercial. Alright, got gross. <laughs>